Hi there, this is Michael from MyChem Videos. Today I'm going to show you how to create this cool, like, kind of looks like paper folded. Um, it's just a cool little effect to do in GIMP. And so, yeah, so let's get started. First thing we're going to want to do is create a new image with the width of 600 and the height of 200. And push OK. Oh, um, and just fill your background with white if you did what I did and yeah now you want to go to your gradient tool make sure it's on linear and just make it a foreground to background and make sure your foreground color is black and your background is white and this little thing right here it's uh, the reverse tool click that okay and yeah then you want to go from one corner to the other and you should get this now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go and you're going to want to grab your text tool and get this disco t deck um, font that I have. I'll have it in the description. And I just find the size 160 works. And make sure your text is white. And just start typing your word. And just make sure to put each of them on a different thing or it will not work properly oh, oh come on sorry guys just a sec there we go okay that's not all the way. <coughs> okay. And just get them all aligned to the center or wherever you want it. There we go. Just do this for all of them. And just make them a few pixels apart. doesn't matter how many okay and I'm just gonna put the word Michael in here and Just get it to where you want it. There we go. Now go down to your first layer and or your your first text layer. Grab your blend tool, take off the switch, bring it back to black as the foreground, white as the background. Change the type to conical asymmetrical or A S Y M <coughs> and just make a new layer above your text and just decide kind of what you want for this M I'm going to go like this and just bring it from where you want it to the end and this one and make sure to change the mode on that new layer to hard light and kind of if you need to um, align it up, up with your image and also if you want because the black part of it will be the fold and if you want the fold to be on the other side just go transform and then you can flip whichever way you want like if I wanted to, well that didn't work that time but you know whichever way you want it now um, which uh, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go to your text layer right click and alpha to selection it now go back up to your layer with the gradient on it and convert or er, invert that um, invert that selection so go to select invert and make sure you clicked on your new layer and go just push delete then you want to go select invert again then you go filters light and shadow drop shadow and make sure that offset X is 0 offset Y is 0 and then the rest just leave the same and push OK and then go select none and you should have this little kinda of looks kinda of folded and then I'll do that and come back and well I'll just do it right here real quick 
Okay. Uh, I'll just do this real quick. Cancel. So on this one right here, I have to flip vertically. That way it's like that. And I'll be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. Uh, sorry. Now, just I'll just keep continuing. I'm just using keyboard shortcuts, that's why you don't see me clicking around a lot. Uh. And just continue. Transform, flip vertically. Okay. Just keep continuing doing this. And so on the L, I'm going to just do it right here. Now I'm just going to change these to hard light so I can see, you know, while I'm doing this. There we go. Now, let me just do this last part real quick. Now that we have this, <clears throat> what we're going to want to do is you want to grab the first drop shadow and bring it right in on top of your first letter, your first text layered letter thing. Then you want to take the second one and put it on top of your second letter. And just continue doing this until you have them all on top of their rightful things. Now, you have that. Now, this is pretty much the last step, and you want to create one more new layer. Just put the transparency at that. Uh, just put it at transparency, and you want to fill the whole thing with this orange. And you just wanted to go F F A two zero 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 or two. J I'll repeat that. F F A two zero zero, and just fill the whole thing with that. Then you want to change the mode on that to soft light and you're done and that's how to create a folded paper effect in GIMP um, please comment rate and subscribe and if you haven't seen the new um, our new website please check it out mikekevinvideos.com and the link will be in the description alright well thanks for watching bye